everybody. Welcome back to Sharon Cullen Art. Today, I am working out in my studio. I really, really, really want to be painting, but that's not going to happen. I am cleaning and getting ready for a kind of remodel update. I have a new desk coming the day after tomorrow, and I want to reorganize all of my storage areas, which is going to take a lot. I have got way too much stuff, more than anybody I know. And so I plan on doing a lot of reorganizing, and I started yesterday, so I'm going to continue on today. Tomorrow's a travel day for me for a doctor's appointment, and uh, it's like four hours of driving plus the appointment. So that's going to consume my day, but Thursday the new desk comes. So I'm going to get ready for all of that and then I will show you my big reveal. Well, I've started another big mess. Right now I have some organizers to try to organize my drawers which are bombed. They're just bombed and there's a lot of stuff removed from this drawer. It was getting so full that I couldn't close it. Same with this one. So um, I've got some organizers. Part of the problem is that this is not a desk. It's a buffet. So these um, drawers are probably a good eight inches deep, which is not desk level. So I keep stacking stuff on top of other stuff. But I bought all these organizers. I decided to put all of my Prismacolor Premier pencils in these cups. And I have ordered my new desk, which will be coming Thursday. So it's going to wrap around this area, and I'll be tucked further, closer to the windows. So I'll be, like, outside. <laughs> and um, I'm looking forward to that. That'll give me a little space so that I can leave my pencils either out there or where this mess is right now. I've got a bomb going on over here. I've got these drawers over here that I'm going to use for things like extra pencils. I mean, I have a whole box of my soft black wings. I have a box of um, the natural black wings, which are the firmest. Um, I've got all sorts of Sharpies. Sharpies like crazy over here. And I think I'm going to start putting most of them in these drawers where my pencils were. I have a bunch of old pens. These old fountain pens that I bought, I think I'm going to take in and use them for sketching. Um, I have china markers in here and things that I got from back when I used to do the sketch box review things and then had the big falling out with them. Um, but anyway, I'm going to keep pens in here. I've got some ink tents in here. My blocks are in here. And then my first set of pencils that I got were in there. Um, I have another box of like 72 or something like that. And then I've got cartridges, uh, converters, all sorts of stuff for my fountain pens. And these are just a few of the fountain pens. I have boxes of fountain pens. And um, so I plan on putting all that in there. And these are all empty. These all held my Prismacolor Premier pencils. Here's some more pencils that are not even sharpened. I like these. They're HB. I have HB and 2H. Uh, I never use 2H on camera because it's so pale you can't see my sketches when I'm doing videos. But I'm going to go ahead and sort everything out. i got garbage everywhere. Um, but I'm going to sort it all out and start going through my drawers. I just finished my harp lesson, so um, I thought Pat has Tully out somewhere. They went for a ride. I don't know if he took him down to the lake or what. We're in the 40s here, I believe, in temperature 41, 42 right now. So he probably took him out to play but I thought I'll get a little bit of work done. So I'm gonna start working on all of this. Like I put my bottles of ink in two of these. Then I do have more, I think I have more, con oh, these are all sample inks that I bought. Some of them are not uh, waterproof, but they'd be great for sketching. And then in this box, I think I have a bunch of converters. Yeah, more converters. So I wanna centralize all that stuff. Um, I've got a ton, a ton of different, um, what do you call them, leads, pencil leads, and 0 .3, 0 .5. I have a ton of blue ones because I love blue. 
uh, to draw with. I've got red. I've got all those different colors that I just got for those other pens. And then for my my pencil, that multicolor pencil, those things break so easy. But I've got a bunch of leads for that, and I have a lead stuck that I can't get out. So now I can't use that pencil. It's really bumming me out. But anyway, I'm going to get busy working on all of this. And then once it's done, I'm going to show you my big reveal of all of my organization. Hopefully it'll be enough. And my new desk, which will go from here all the way to the window and all the way to about here. Then this is gonna all get moved down. Those white things are gonna disappear. And this is gonna get moved down toward the window. And if I have enough space, I might get one of those seven drawer Ikea um, cart things because that would work really great for <sighs> desk related things. And then I could put more of my watercolor papers and stuff in there because right now I have this which is getting stuck with some of my watercolor paper there's just tons and tons and tons and tons I don't use it as often as I was but when I'm doing commissions or regular paintings I'm using those and then down here these are all watercolor palettes and they go on forever I mean forever I've got Schmincke palettes that I don't use, Renaissance, um, Fine Text. There's another Schmincke that's not even been opened that I ended up with given to me. My Portable Painter, Old Cotman's um, from years ago. I mean, there's so many different, different things in here. And my old standby favorite that I used to, to use all the time, my Stadler pencil case that I made my own homemade palette with, which I love. I think I'm gonna spray this with enamel paint and then I can use it again, but I love it because it's got all the basic colors that I need and I used to use it all the time. And it's very small, you know, very lightweight and small. But I also use those um, art toolkit business card ones. So anyway, enough talking. I'm gonna get done with this and then I will show you my big reveal. So in the meantime, be courageous, paint with wild abandon, and most of all, be kind to each other. Stay tuned for the big reveal coming soon. Love you guys. God bless you. Bye-bye. Are you just sitting there enjoying the sunshine? You sure are a cutie. Yeah, with your little winky eyes, you're a cutie. He's out.